And this just gets more and more exciting. I will say welcome back, young professor. I actually missed you. Did you? Let's go. I, mean, I don't think Mikey Spandex will be happy to hear that, but I, but I certainly am. Thank you. Yeah, well, I, I mean, I didn't think there was going to be somebody uh, that I disliked more, but, you know. Hey, I resemble that. But you know something, Brittany? Let's focus up. Let's make sure we do our job here. You exactly. know what? Our job should be easy to do because oh, these shit. two women are two of the hardest hitting competitors in this entire tournament. And we are officially now in the semifinals. Queen Aminata, Shaw Guerrero. And I said before you came back to the commentary, I said two queens in their own right here in wrestling. This match is pure fire. No argument there. You see a head scissor locked in deep from Shaw Guerrero. But Queen Aminata doing all she can to maneuver her way out of it. Flexibility now on display. And a little bit of chain wrestling. Queen Aminata with a side headlock. Shaw trying desperately to get out of it. Manages to get back up to a vertical base. I mean, this is the thing. We have seen Queen Aminata do whatever it takes. Oh, oh. Roll up. She's got locked in deep. Like Aminata I rolls through. Doing whatever it takes. And Go again. Rest. You know, as hard hitting as Queen Aminata is, she needs to have eyes in the back of her head against a Guerrero. We saw it earlier. Right now, Shaw Guerrero playing by the rules, but you got to wonder how long she's going to keep that up based on what we saw earlier tonight. Oh. And as I said before, you have to watch out for those legs of Aminata. I mean, she can kick. Well, not only is she powerful, she's also remarkably quick. Mm -hmm. that, that kick struck Shaw Guerrero out of nowhere. Right now, Shaw, though, trying to fight her way back into it. Between oh. Aminata locks her up again. Again, that explosive oh. power. And that modified reverse Russian sweep, driving Shaw Guerrero face first into the mat. Face first, right into the match. The referee checking oh. on Shaw, but Queen oh Aminata God. assuring her it's okay. Because she's a Guerrero. That's what she said. That's right. Adding a little mockery to the Guerrero name. Queen Aminata oh. driving her face first in. After this, Shaw might have a whole different facial structure. Well, we mentioned that Shaw Guerrero has been away from the ring, at least as a competitor for some time. She was successful in her outing earlier, but you gotta wonder, being away this long, she's probably not, not, not only is she not used to working one match in one night, but this is her second match, and Queen Aminata is in tip-top shape. She's in supreme condition. She does this all over the world. She is ready for this match, and hopefully Shaw Guerrero can keep pace. But right now, Aminata Ooh. has her twisted up like a pretzel. And she does indeed, like you said, she does this all over the world. Aminata went and trained in Japan for four months. She was sleeping in the dojo. She ate, slept, and breathed wrestling there in Japan. And she came back with a whole new bag of tricks. Well, it shows just how bad she wants it. And that's the kind of thing that you want to see here when we're having a tournament such as this for the Diamond Cup. Somebody who is hungry for opportunity. And Aminata is ready to show everybody here that she's not handed anything. She's not part of a legacy. She doesn't have the blood in her veins like some of the other competitors here. She is here to show that she is just as qualified, just as ready, and here she comes! Oh, that juicy, juicy world going in there. And there comes that running food oh, again! Nick. She might have knocked her out there. That is her signature. It is basically a TKO, and Shaw oh. Guerrero is seeing stars. Welcome back to the ring, Shaw Guerrero. Queen Aminata looking to pull her away. Just like that. Oh, but Shaw able to get her shoulder up at two and a half. That was a close call by any count. Aminata not happy at all with that count. Thinking she had this in the bag and was able to move on to the finals. Uh-oh. Oh. Shaw catches her. She went for another one of those running kicks. But Shaw now oh. drops her face first right into the knee. You can see Queen Aminata counting her teeth there. Shaw with the cover. Only a count of one. Aminata still with a lot of gas left in the tank. I mean, of course, Aminata. She was the first match of the night. She has had a length to breathe, to rest, to prepare for this match. Shaw, not so much. A little bit this time, but both women managed to survive extremely competitive matches here tonight. Look at this. Oh, my oh. goodness. Interesting body scissor submission. It's almost like an octopus going on there. Yes. 
But not only is she wrenching on various body parts of Shaw Guerrero, she's also forcing her to maintain both of their weight, exhausting her in the process. This is a wise maneuver from Queen Aminata. I mean, Shaw trying to get to the ropes. Aminata trying to lock her up. I mean, uh -oh. oh! Shaw oh. drops her. And regardless. She manages to get a cover out of it as well. But not quite enough to put away Queen Aminata. Uh, indeed, but that was definitely an impressive submission, and you got to be feeling it. Oh! Speaking of submissions, that looks like Texas Cloverleaf. Oh, wait a minute, she's got her shoulders down. Shaw looking to go tit for tat with Aminata, showing you want a submission, I'll give you a submission. Yeah. Shades of Dean Malenko, one of the good friends, of course, of Eddie Guerrero. Oh. Second, third generation superstar in Shaw Guerrero. Oh! Uh oh, Aminata powers her way up, bridges up, trying to oh, crawl and fight her way to the outside, trying to get that rope and regardless, force the referee to break it. If she gets the rope, regardless, she is going to be tired those, after this. Those long limbs of Queen Aminata coming in handy there, no pun intended. But Shaw Guerrero hangs on until four and a half just to inflict as much punishment as possible. You can't blame her. She is trying to move on to the finals here. And as we can see, it's going to take everything that both of these women have in order to make it that far. Drop toe hold into the second rope. And regardless of Aminata getting to the ropes, that had to. Ah, sharp kick right to the back of the skull of Shaw Guerrero. Aminata using what she has left. Smiling as if she is uh, slightly dazed and confused. Oh. And just, oh! She hits her with that spinning neck breaker. Uh, that fisherman suplex hold. That might be enough. She put somebody away earlier. But Shaw Guerrero able to power out with a kick out at two and a half. Surviving on here. Amiata with another cover. Shaw Guerrero hanging on with all she's got for dear life. Trying to make it into the finals. Yes, she is. Oh, adding a little. Uh, insult to injury there. Just trying to use all of her weight, trying to take any advantage she can to put away Shaw Guerrero, but unsuccessful in her effort yes. so far. Oh. Well, Aminata going for a chair here. We saw a chair come into play at the end of Shaw Guerrero's last bit. Two uh, chairs. I mean, this is not a no disqualification match. Not, you cannot we... use the chairs in this tournament. Oh, wait a minute, there's a chair in play though. Oh, oh no. wait a minute, we what? saw this earlier. <laughs> oh, a wise veteran what? maneuver from Shaw Guerrero, leaving a little ambiguity for the referee so that the decision can't be rendered quite so easily. I don't know what you're talking about. I am so confused as to who got hit with the chair. Uh, the answer is no What's one, Brittany. Are you I watching know, the match with clearly. me? Oh, look at this. Wait a minute. Clearly wait a minute. She's hooked up. Hit. Shaw Guerrero. Oh, wait a minute. The referee had her back turned, not able to make a count in time. There was no one rolled up. What are you talking Shaw about? Shaw kicked to the midsection. Looking for the three Amigas. Shaw There's angry Uno. Do it again. Do it again. And we see Trace. The three Amigas from Shaw Guerrero. Here we go. Looking to put away Aminata. No. The queen will not be defeated that easily. This is what the Diamond Cup is all about, Even Brittany. Even when she's gotten hit by a chair by Shaw Guerrero. No one got hit by a chair, Brittany. It I saw it. Aminata oh, trying to use the tactics of the Guerrero family against Shaw, but Shaw able to outsmart it. That's why oh, she is. Oh, wait a second. Aminata's got her locked in. Oh! And a three count. The winner of this contest by pinfall and advancing to the finals, Queen Aminata. Aminata pulling out all the stops with that quick roll up and one, two, three. She is one step closer to getting the Diamond Cup.